She's a diamond. She's a diamond girl. She's a diamond. Diamond, diamond, diamond. Hi YouTube, it's Princess Diamond. Welcome and welcome back to my channel. So in this video, I will be showing how to mold down hair for when you're doing two feet in braids. Uh, and I'm starting out with freshly washed and blow dried hair with n absolutely no products in it because any products that you put, any oils or anything is going to mess with the products that you will be using. And the products I'll be using is Shine and Gem in the orange container as well as Slick and Slay Edge Gel. You want that Shine and Jam, and you can use either the Shine and Jam in the orange container or you can also use the Shine and Jam in the red container. But then you also want a much thicker, heavier gel or jam. I'm doing a straight middle part and I'm cleaning up the part using the Shine and Jam in the orange container. And of course, you can use, you can do whatever part you prefer. You can do a curved part, a zigzag part however you or your client wants the part to be. All right, so I'm starting with the first half and what I'm doing is making small section parts starting from the front of her head all the way to the back of her head. And then I'm applying the Shine and Jam, that's an orange container, to directly to her scalp. And I'm doing that as if like I'm greasing her scalp. Um, for this you'll be using a lot of products so you don't need to use the thicker gel especially since the thicker gels are usually more pricey so you can save your your money and just use the shine and jam for this part and i'm just going to continue this all the way through the entire first half After I've done that, I'm still using the same Shine and Jam, and this time I'm now applying it all around that first section that I'm doing. But instead of applying it directly to her scalp, this time I'm laying it against her hair. Then I'm going to now use the Slick and Slay, or in your case, whichever thicker edge gel you have to now go back over top of what, um, over top of the Shine and Jam. I'm just doing it over the same section. And now once everything is applied is when I'll start molding the hair. And I'm just going to um, comb and mold the hair exactly where I want the braid to be. So if you want the braid to be centered, then that's where you're going to mold it. If you want it to be more towards the perimeter of the head, then you will want to mold it a little further down. So I'm going to use the comb to comb through and then my finger to lay it flat. And once I got it to where I want the braid to be, then I'll begin to do my feed and braid. And keep watching because after I do the feed and braids, I'm going to show you guys how to smooth out both sides once you've done the feed and braids.
And once I have the braids in, I'm going to use the end of the rat tail comb to try to smooth out the hair as best as I can just to make it look a little more neater. And I'm just kind of just trying to tuck away the hair in the braid. And again, that's just to get it to be smooth, more smooth as best as possible. And that's it. I'm going to do a few finishing touches, putting some mousse on the braid and dipping the ends of the braids in hot water to seal the ends. But that's it. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like the video, hit the thumbs up. Also subscribe to the channel if you have not already. And I'll talk to you guys in my next video. I hope you guys be blessed, stay protected and stay filled with love and peace. Bye guys.